We're only four days into the new year and Rockstar are already cooking something up, it seems. This is their Instagram and they have cleared it out yet again. Only leaving the GTA 6 posts, a couple of some GTA Plus posts that are the active month, as well as a couple of the active events in GTA Online and Red Dead Online. So what does this mean? Are we going to be getting some new GTA 6 info soon? Well, that's what we'll take a look at in today's video. So I want to remind everyone that this is actually what happened before the GTA 6 trailer launched. Rockstar decided to clear pretty much every single post on their Instagram, except for the GTA 6 trailer launch date post there. They more than likely did this just so when the trailer did come out, it could be easily found. It's not cluttered by a bunch of stuff. But the reason I'm bringing this back up is because the last time they did something here to their Instagram, they did give us new GTA 6 footage. Well, the first GTA 6 footage. So are we getting something soon? Why are they doing this to their Instagram again? Now, maybe just the social media guy was bored and was like, you know what? I'm going to go through and, you know, delete some of the older stuff. But this actually makes a lot more sense when it comes to GTA 6's marketing. Obviously, there's not a whole lot of people still interested in GTA Online and Red Dead Online. They're still producing content for them, but... I think at this point, most people are excited, of course, for GTA 6, because that's the game we all want to see. So by having their Instagram here only showcase the active things in GTA Online, like the Chop Shop update, uh, the Park Ranger, I guess, is the new vehicle that came out today or at some point. So you can get that. The Red Dead Online, you know, that's the new event. And I guess they also have their Circo Loco Records. That's their music studio or music thing. And then these are the GTA Plus events for this month so i'm assuming next month you know they'll delete these put the new ones up next week they'll delete you know one of these gta online things put the new one up and it'll just be a nice little consolidated thing here on their instagram which leads us to the gta 6 marketing one thing that i think they're gonna end up doing is something like the Vought international account did on twitter for the tv show the boys now if you haven't heard of that good show but they basically were using this twitter account as sort of like an in-game promotional uh, sort of marketing stunt if we just scroll down here all of these different videos all of these different posts are the account acting like it would be in the show like all of these videos and stuff it's it's basically what it would be in world and we've actually seen in the gta 6 trailer the social media aspect is going to be a major part of this game. They showed it a ton. I mean, here's just a couple of examples. I don't know if this is parodying, you know, Instagram reels, TikToks, whatever. It's parodying them all, I'm sure. But there were a lot of these social media posts in the trailers. So what I think is actually going to end up happening is if we hop back over here to the Instagram, instead of just getting a newswire post with some new screenshots or like a Twitter post with some new screenshots, I think Rockstar are going to go that same route that the boys TV show did. And they're going to actually start posting the social media clips from in-game on their Instagram. That's probably why they're clearing out a bunch of stuff to make room for the upcoming marketing. And honestly, I think that's a fantastic way to go about it. It doesn't give us like a whole bunch of information, so we're not getting spoiled with a bunch of stuff. But it does give us a really cool look at certain aspects in the game. We get to see more of the world, more of the NPCs. It's definitely going to be a lot of fun to see them in the marketing. And then, you know, in a year's time when the game comes out to see him again in the game. So I think that's what Rockstar is getting ready to start doing. If anyone was wondering, oh, they cleared out the Instagram. Are we getting a trailer two already? I don't think we're getting a trailer two already, guys. It's only been a month. We're probably not going to get that trailer two until maybe summer. But if they do sort of these little posts where they have little Instagram reels, uh, like from the trailer or just some new ones that they've worked on, I'm sure they have a ton of them in game that they're ready to show. That would be such a cool way to to market the game. And it's again, not something like major Rockstar's not showcasing like anything crazy. It's just a way to keep the marketing going, keep the hype building, keep people talking about your game. And it would just be cool from our perspectives to see what the Floridians or the Leonidians, I don't know what we got to call them uh, in the world, like on, on TikTok, on Instagram here, it would be cool and funny to see what they're, what those characters and NPCs are getting up to. Now, the only other thing I'll mention is it is rumored here that the next earnings call, the next like conference call with Take-Two and all that is going to be February 4th. 
it is projected so it might be like a day or two before this or after this but it's probably gonna be around that time and then you can see the other three that are projected may 14th august 4th and then november 5th obviously the last earnings call that's the same day that rockstar announced gta 6 so maybe february they have another announcement of some sort maybe they give us some new information about the world about maybe the map i don't know but that's probably the next big date to look forward to and also we can see in this earnings call if they've changed any of the numbers if they're still you know expecting fiscal 2025 to hit eight million or eight billion dollars or if they've pushed that back but yeah it's uh pretty interesting what are rockstar cooking up here what are they doing what do you guys think let us know in the comment section down below that's gonna do it for today's gta 6 video please drop it a like if you did enjoy subscribe for more gta 6 content of course if they do post anything here i will i will keep you guys up to date let you guys know we'll do breakdowns and all that so hit the subscribe button again if you are new and are interested in all of that sort of content anyways as always i'll see you guys in the next one